Often you may want to apply conditional formatting to cells or rows based on multiple conditions in Excel. Conditional formatting based on multiple conditions in one column. Create multiple rules for multiple conditions. For example, highlight the cells in sales column containing values less than 3000 and greater than 5000. Select the range which you want to highlight, E2 to E14. On the Home tab in the Styles group, click on Conditional Formatting and select New Rule. Select Format Only Cells that contain. In the Format Only Cells with, select Cell Value. In the next drop down, select Less Than. Enter 2000. Click on Format. Format Cells dialog box opens. In the Format Cells dialog window, choose the desired font, border and background color respectively. If you want more colors than the standard palette provides, click on the More Colors button on the Fill tab. To apply a gradient background color, click on the Fill Effects button on the Fill tab and choose the desired options. Once you select the colors and pattern, click on OK you will see a preview of the fill format. Click on OK. In the new formatting rule, click on OK to apply the rule. Sales less than 2000 will be highlighted. Now follow the same steps and create another rule. Make sure the same cells are selected. In the new formatting rule window, select greater than and enter 5000. Select a format and click on OK. Sales less than 2000 and greater than 5000 are highlighted. You can add many conditional formatting rules to the same cell and range in order to get the desired effect. One thing to keep in mind when creating multiple rules on the same cells is the order of precedence. When each rule applies to different aspects of formatting like font, border, fill, etc., you don't have to worry about the order of precedence. The issue arises when multiple rules are adjusting the same formatting element. For example, these rules are created to highlight sales greater than 5000 in green and greater than 7000 in blue and a black border. The rules don't seem to be working as sales greater than 7000 are not highlighted in blue, only the black border is applied. The rules are out of order. To go to Conditional Formatting Rules Manager, select a cell. In the Home tab, click on Conditional Formatting and click on Manage Rules. The rule on the top will always take precedence. So once the sales value is greater than 5000, the cell is highlighted in green. You can fix this by moving the rules. Select the greater than 7000 rule and click on the up arrow in the top of the window to move the rule up. Basically, you must put the rules in what seems like reverse order to get them to apply correctly when they format the same aspect of the cell such as background color. Now click on apply, click on OK to close the window. The cells are highlighted correctly. Conditional formatting based on multiple conditions using AND function. To highlight a row based on multiple conditions in different columns, you can use the AND function. The row is highlighted when all the conditions are met. For example, to highlight rows which have sales rep ME and sales greater than 5000, we can use the AND function. Select the range and click on Conditional Formatting and select New Rule. Select Use a formula to determine which cells to format option. Enter this formula in the format values where this formula is true box. The formula returns true when both conditions are true. Click on Format and select a format. Click on OK. Preview shows the selected format. Click on OK. The rows meeting both the conditions that is where sales rep is ME and sales value is greater than 5000 are highlighted. To highlight rows based on multiple conditions in a single column, you can use the OR function. The rows will be highlighted if any of the conditions are met. For example, to highlight the rows where sales value is less than 2000 or greater than 5000, use this formula. The formula returns true when any one condition is met and the rows are highlighted. Highlight rows based on multiple conditions in different columns using OR function. For example, to highlight the rows where sales value is greater than 5000 or region is west, use this formula. 
the formula returns true when any one of the conditions is met rose where sales value is greater than 5000 or region is equal to west or highlighted conditional formatting based on multiple conditions using if function instead of using the and function you can also use the if function for multiple conditions for example to highlight rows which have sales rep as amy and sales greater than 5000 use this formula the formula returns true only if both the if functions return true all the rows where sales rep is equal to amy and sales greater than 5000 are highlighted conditional formatting based on multiple conditions using if and or functions for example to highlight rows where region is equal to east or west and sales greater than 5000 use this formula the or function returns true if the region is east or west the formula returns true if the or function returns true and second if also returns true all rows where region is east or west and sales value greater than 5000 are highlighted to download practice excel file please click on the link in the description if you like this video please subscribe to our channel